I was reading a book recently and I realized that sometimes things happen for a reason even if we don't like that reason. In 2017, I suffered a flood in this very room. This meant I had to move out of this room on a more than temporary basis. It was for about four weeks while the carpets dried out, the ceiling was repainted, and the whole room got a bit of a makeover. During that time, it crossed the period of my mother's birthday. And I also wrote two tracks that I quite like in that time period. On the day of the flood, my mum came to help me out because I needed help quickly moving the contents of the room out of it. She missed a hospital appointment as a result of helping me. I don't know whether that contributed to her passing away in August of the same year, but it's been on my mind ever since. I doubt it, but I'll never know. A result, however, of having this flood and having my mum visit was that I was upstairs in the bedroom, living in there for long periods of time and unable to create music in my usual space. And as I said previously, I made tracks up there that I wouldn't have made otherwise. This is not one of them. On July 23rd, 2017, I decided to get out of the house and take my mum her birthday present. So I jumped in an Uber and I went and visited her. Had I been living downstairs and flood free, I may not have gone over to her birthday and visited her on that day and just spoken to her by phone. So the last memory that I had of her would be pre-flood and pre-birthday. As a result, I did spend a wonderful day with my mum. We went out for a barbecue and had a great time. So, two weeks after, when she passed away, unfortunately, I have only good memories of the last time of seeing my mother alive. Had the flood not happened, I don't know the last memory I would have had of her because I cannot remember the time before she came to help me out with the flood. That would have stuck with me for the rest of my days. But of course I had been none the wiser because the flood didn't happen. Everything for a reason, even if that reason is not something we like. I've had a few years to come to terms with this now, but it doesn't mean it doesn't hurt every single day. What if? And that's the problem, isn't it? We cannot live our lives thinking of what-ifs. There's no point to it. We can just enjoy the time we have on this earth and treat our fellow humans like humans. Live, love and laugh the best you can. For that is the only thing we should be capable of. Work hard, play hard have fun. Those are the things you should strive to do the very best you can. Be safe. I'll speak to you again soon.